Developing now, the faithful in New Jersey are calling on a higher power to get them through a difficult time. A church inferno destroyed their place of worship just weeks before Easter. Fire crews across two states were part of the effort to contain these flames at the Fountain of Life Center in Burlington County. The congregation will meet today to discuss what's the best way to move forward. Action News reporter Catherine Scott is live in Florence Township where crews remain this morning. Good morning, Catherine. Good morning, guys. No injuries have been reported, but there's a lot of damage here at this church. You can still see smoke rising from the church. Uh, there are flare ups here as well. Crews have been here throughout the night, flooding water onto hot spots. As time went on and I kept watching it burn, it just got harder and harder to watch. Pastor Russ has said multiple times, um, this is just a building and we're the church. So the building can burn, right? But we're the church and so the building doesn't matter. In this video, you can see the cross collapsing and the heavy flames and the devastating eight alarm fire at Fountain of Life Center in Florence Township. The fire broke out around six o'clock last night. Authorities say kids were playing basketball in the rear of the church and saw the smoke. The flames spread fast, churning through the building, engulfing the church. More than 150 firefighters from South Jersey and Pennsylvania responded. The fire appeared to be placed under control by 11 p.m. Crews did meet some challenges, including a limited water supply. Now, they know that's an issue in this area, and they have plans in place going to fill stations to bring water in to fight the fire. Portable ponds set up in the parking lot. Life Center Academy, a school next door, was not damaged. Classes are canceled there today. Pastors say they will rebuild and hold service in a different building on Sunday. Truly, it is, it's a building. It's a building, and we're so blessed. Behind this building, we have a huge rec center, and so we're going to be able to hold services there. Um, it's like three basketball courts together. We have bleachers that hold nearly 1,000 people, and so we're going to be able to, while we rebuild, and we will rebuild, and we believe we'll be stronger than ever. And back here live where you can still see the glow of the flames. Officials believe this blaze may have started in the sanctuary of the church. The cause of this fire remains under investigation today. We're live in Florence Township. Catherine Scott, Channel 6 Action News.